I hate for you to see me like this, Sarah, but what can I do? It's the system! Obviously, I'm only here because of the prison industrial complex, lobbying for more victimless crimes to turn a profit. Dude, you're here because you tried to become a dictator. Pretty sure people died. Well, there shouldn't be private prisons anyway. They're just incentives for mass imprisonment. Uh, look around. These aren't all failed dictators. This isn't a private prison, though, is it? No, it's not. And the truth is, there aren't as many private prisons in America as most people like to think. As of 2019, only around 8% of inmates were held in private facilities at the state or federal level. A bit less than 100,000 people total. That's still a lot of people, but private prisons didn't create the over-incarceration problem. They're mostly a way to cope with out-of-control costs and slow bureaucracy in an environment where almost 1.5 million people are in prison. And they're also all managed by the Department of Corrections, the Department of Justice, and other agencies across the country. In the end, they're not much different in quality than state facilities like this one. Come on, I have to buy toilet paper from a vending machine. Evil lobbyists are making big bucks off my digestive tract, which is doing great since my jailhouse kombucha has taken off, by the way. Uh, th thanks for that information. We tried to bring some, but the guards wouldn't let Florida Man's gator in. It was stuffed full of it, head to tail. Well, you are right about one thing. Lobbying has played a role in the huge increase in incarceration rates in the US. Both the police union and the prison guards unions have lobbied in favor of stricter sentencing requirements, mandatory minimum sentences, and in favor of the federal war on drugs. But private prisons really don't explain the origins, extent, or long-term effect of America's imprisonment problem. Yeah, why not point a finger at the people who are actually responsible? The government! Harumph! Maybe I can fix some things from the inside. Whittle my own lobbyist out of a bar of soap or something. That is, if the guards don't search my cell again. Yeah, great seeing you, Ron, but we should probably get going on account of the prison riot. Nah, it's mostly peaceful. Uh, just concerned inmates demanding their fair share of toilet paper. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more educational cartoons. We drop one every two weeks. Boy, oh boy, do we love doing it. So you subscribe so we can continue. Thank you.